Hi, it's Gene from Mavstar Observatory. Good evening. Guys, um, we're going to go through this in a minute, uh, and there's a good reason why we are talking about the coronavirus and the UK government website. And it is legit, trust me. Uh, this link was sent to me by someone in the video that I put up yesterday, because uh, we was touching on the subject of the human rights and things like that. So I thought it was absolutely worthy of bringing it to the rest of our attentions because of the relevance of it. But we're going to talk about a few other things as well. In particular, um, the doctrination which is taking place right now on YouTube. On my last video, it's showing less than a thousand views. And I'm going to prove to you guys in this video 100% that that's bullshit. Uh, the reason why they are able to do that and get away with it is because it's actually uh, falling through some loopholes but um, it is very damaging to sites like mine, uh, channels like mine and we're going to try and get to the bottom of it. You know, I'm not like a normal person as you probably know. Uh, give me enough motivation and then you, re you will get my time invested in you and that is exactly what we're going to do with YouTube. We're going to piss about with their little algorithms and see exactly what it is they they are tuned up to do and to start with uh, one of the tests we're going to give them is we're going to cancel the advertising on this video that we're uploading so we're not interested in earning revenue off the advertisement and i'll tell you reasons why i'll do that uh, and then i'll get on to why we're looking at this website right now so the one of the reasons i'm getting fed up with, with the youtube advertisement is yes it does help but only marginally, you know, the money we raise off the adverts isn't really worth it. Every thousand views, we might be lucky and get 80 pence, which is not even a pound. Doesn't even buy you a cup of coffee at any reasonable coffee shop. So that's why I'm not really interested in the revenue off this video. But I want to see what difference it makes. The other reason I'm getting fed up with these adverts is because I believe they are being targetly driven to uh, put people off watching the content and supporting others and they will therefore choose specifically minded videos with psychology placed behind them in the fact that when people watch the video uh, watch one of my videos they incorporate some of these advertisements and then you know after you've been drained by you know the type of advertisements that we're getting on our videos now on this channel uh, i'm not surprised you know by the time they get to my end of my video they no longer want to help you know a worthy course like an observatory you know that is trying to inform people of you know some serious changes and give them back some truth as to what is causing these changes and we have taken it right back up the line guys we have taken it right back up the line to two things as you know if you've been watching these videos back up at the top of this food chain where all these things are occurring from is an increase in cosmic rays because of two reasons a magnetic pole reversal and a grand solar minimum and you know as you go further down the links you know we see you know suicides like we covered the other day from farmers one a day in the uk um you know thousands around the world are committing suicide because they have lost the ability to judge one of those things that should be you know um standard which is seasons where you put your crops in this is something right that most of the archaeology um that we've got in our history like the structures of egypt uh, the Mayan structures, you know, um, over here in the UK, Stonehenge, were all built around the seasons. You can predict, using those stones today, the uh, summer solstice and the winter solstice accurately. That That is, you know, without divulging too far, far off the uh, course, it just shows us that one thing has not happened. You know, we have not yet seen a rotational axis change. But... You know, these monuments don't go back more than 20,000 years. So whether something happened with a rotational axis back then is another story. Getting back to this, this is the UK government's website. And I would show you uh, the banner in the search bar to prove that. But I'm sure if you just pick up on some of the 
things that he's mentioned in this, what I'm about to show you, you will you know, very easily come across it yourself. And there's an important reason. So just to square up where we are right now, we are going to be investigating YouTube's algorithms over the coming few videos. We're going to be throwing some things at them and just waiting for the response and then testing that response to see if it's the same and then changing you know the circumstances and then testing those circumstances again to see if we get a change what we want to know is what YouTube are using as part of their algorithms and I think once we find that we'll find out the reason why they're doing it as well but I think it's pretty reasonable to um, suspect at this point is what they want to do is stop people talking about elections around the world stop people talking about you know uh, red flags stop people talking about conspiracies you know and and just drive a narr narrative to you know try and give people the security that the government is that beautiful tender loving granny who will only nourish and care for you well you know i think that the curtain is slowly being peeled away and what we're seeing is the huge pigs at the trough feeding frenzies at the money that is coming in through the government ta through the public taxpayers purse and it is open season like it has never been before and things like coronavirus present perfect opportunities to steal mounting loads of money and stock up the bank accounts of these aristocrat bastards that you know are still around today and have been over the you know over decades going back into our history you know in the second world war i don't like deviating because you've got to realize by now that this is all true second world war rich american family owned a factory in germany americans and the british were going to bomb the factory because it was a munitions uh, uh, factory and because it was american owned you know it was called off at the last minute just go figure and you know these facts can be checked if you don't believe them it's like you know the war of uh, Kentonkin and things like that you go back and check them all you'll find that there are suspicious circumstances you know one of the biggest is 9-11 after all anyhow have a look at this guys what we've got here this is what one of our subscribers showed us right status of COVID-19 as of March 2020 COVID-19 is no longer considered a high consequence infection disease HCID in the UK the four nations public health HCID group made an interim recommendation in January 2020 to classify COVID-19 as a HCID uh, this was based on the uh, consideration of the UK HCID criteria about various um, about viruses uh, sorry and diseases with information available during early stages of the outbreak now that more is known about COVID-19 the public health bodies in the UK have reviewed um, the most up-to-date information about COVID-19 against the UK HCID criteria they have determined that several features have now changed in particular more information is available about the mortality rates bracket low overall closed battery and there is now greater clinical awareness of specific sensitive laboratory tests available of which continues to increase the advisory committee on dangerous pathogens apcdp uh, is of the opinion that covid19 should no longer be classified as hcid so what do you make of that it was known in march and they have enforced all these laws and you know not even the hcid is interested in you know uh controlling the situation they've passed it to the local government or the advisory committee can you believe that how many millions of people's lives have been destroyed you know through loss of earnings how many people 
have uh, or will do lose their house as this continues and it is no longer classified uh, by the HCID as you know even being worthy of their involvement it's amazing isn't it guys it is nothing but a pack of lies in my opinion to make money and we see this on YouTube the channels that get taken away overnight are the channels where doctors have came out themselves and said this is not what we see as you know we are probably doing more damage and the death rate is increasing because we are putting people on incubation artificial breathing apparatus and in some cases we are over inflating the lungs damaging them and that's why they you know they do not recover and we've on top of this also seen you know people that have had a car accident or died of the car accident being classed as dying of covid-19 to boost up the numbers of deaths of covid-19 now there is a kingpin somewhere in this world running the show we need to invest a little bit of effort in finding out who that person is and revealing their identity because I will tell you now if you are really the kingpin of the show who runs you know all these people it is in the interest of yours to make that publicly aware I'm telling you now we have an invisible ghost in the room and we need to identify who that is because that is the person that is running things like this running 9-11 running you know the 2007 bankruptcies that took place and stock market crashes we need to find out who this person is because there will be one head at the top and it will be the biggest and the fattest pig i guarantee you that and I, we we've talked about this me and a few you know really smart intelligent people that person is a ghost he has no intention of being revealed and he will protect his um, personal life very dearly because if he is ever revealed he's got seven billion people on his back and we need to make an effort guys to find out who that is we need to you know expose you know the algorithms that are at work so that people can see it for themselves and take action because what is happening right now is an erosion of your free rights globally and that is unacceptable that should be the final line that we cross because of you know this behavior it's all about money greed corruption all those things that brought about the end times in the bible and brought about the destruction by the floods brought about the destruction of the city of gomorrah it's the same behavior back here again and it will bring the destruction down upon ourselves if we do not act it's as simple as that i'll just show you what youtube are doing on my own channel because that's all i can do i don't have access to all the other people's accounts but if i can reveal how youtube are manipulating you know sites that have a truth movement or you know trying to inform people of the truth or you know they just don't simply like us because we do a better job than mainstream organizations like nasa european space agency etc then we will expose them and we need to so i'll show you now exactly what youtube are doing to my channel so as you can see here i've highlighted the amount of views we've had and they're saying that we've had those views in the last 29 hours one day five hours and as you can see it's at uh, 9 11 funnily enough you know isn't that a weird number anyway um, it's at 911 now I'm going to show you how many views we really have and the reason I can show you that is because the only thing my adverts are paid on is this channel and so if we go into Google AdSense and you see what I'm being paid for you'll also see how many views we've had in the last 29 hours or at least 24 hours and I guarantee you now it will not be 911 
Okay, so we've had to use the beta version of the report because I can't believe it. I didn't check this before I, I told you guys I was going to show you, but you can clearly see 4,132 views. Uh, on the 2nd of September was when the video was launched. I'll also show you today's number, so you add that to the 4,000, so there's another 1,400, so nearly 6,000 views we've had on that video that they're not showing you, and you're not going to be able to see uh, later on because I guarantee you now they will do away with this beta version of uh, AdSense reports um, it's amazing isn't it they are closing and narrowing down the loop and they are forcing the sheep through the gate and you know what if people don't act you know things like freedom channels and freedom of information will soon disappear and is that really where we want to be? Do we just want to be in a position where we accept everything that the government tell us? Because before long, we're going to end up just like Truman did in the Truman Show. Where everything is fake. And we aren't far from that at the moment, guys. You know, this is just making people's lives a misery globally. Because of the greed and the corruption and the wickedness you know people need to pay attention it is the time and you know what it is really the time as well to so start supporting channels like this even if you don't want to support it for the fact that we do all the research and we've got the equipment globally in the field you know bringing it back to you guys even if it's just videos like this of informing you of the big changes that are taking place which will affect your lives and the information that you receive you should fund it for either one of those reasons but more i would like you to fund it because this is an observatory and you know if you've been following me i've been on youtube for eight ten years or even more you know it was never about advertisement at one point but you know so many people said to me switch on the advert revenue and at least you can earn a little bit of money and I did that and now look how we're being persecuted for using those tools that they provide look how I was persecuted when I had the last video and there was that little uh, carrot dangled in front of me saying you know you can monetize your channel and ask for subscription fees it seemed really easy and simple and I weren't being greedy when I did it but you know what happened they closed the channel down so you know what you have to understand is when you are up against the grain and you have no money you stand very little chance when you've got some support from some people like Douglas Cadell um, Jenny Bob Kathy and a few others, Susan um, in San Francisco, Brian and a few others who regularly support this channel and they, their numbers are getting smaller and smaller guys for some reason. But when you've got a teeny bit of support, you can do a bit more. When you've got a little bit more support than that, you can push it a little bit further. And that's where we're at right now. That's what we need to do is keep channels funded like this Firstly, for the information that we provide on the geomagnetic reversal. And secondly, for the bringing of the truths to you over the last two days, you have received lots of information on. And I've showed you the laws that have been broken. I've showed you the lies with regards to COVID-19. I've showed you how they're manipulating YouTube figures to make us people look insignificant so that nobody thinks they're of importance and they should really give us a go and follow us that's what it's all about and that's what's at risk now so links down there if you want to help support us and the only other thing to say is you know what i usually do bye for now